Hey, hey, welcome to another Rocket League video. I've been kind of obsessed with Rocket League. Anyway, uh, today I'm going to talk about my pet peeves of Rocket League. And the best way for me to really express these opinions. I could write them down, I could play and write them down, and then and then whatever. But, if I actually play with the people who do this kind of stuff, then it will enrage me and get me to rant and you could get my true feelings on it. So, let's do that. So, as you could tell, um, I'm gold. You know, I used to be platinum for a long while. I got into a bad streak. I'm not gonna say all of it was teammates, but uh, a lot of it was teammate fault. And now I can't get out of gold because now I'm playing with gold teammates, not platinum teammates. It's hard to work with. So let's let's try to win some matches. But I will be I will be mad the entire time, probably. Let's just do it. All right, snarf the barf. All right, so. So this guy seems to be rotating pretty well. Oh, well, that was my fault, damn it. Punch that right over. Ugh. I couldn't I couldn't get up to speed there. Yeah, the the first person I work with is going to be an actual good good player feels like. He's going he's going he's going to screw something up and I'm going to get mad. Like that. So I what okay, so I was the thing this was gonna be my first pet peeve I talked about, but it's a pet peeve. When people play forward and then they stop. Like they go too hard on the D and then they fucking whiff and get us a goal. But a big thing uh why is my mic so fucking loud? Alright, this should be better. Jesus fucking Christ. But a big thing is when people play forward and then they just fucking stop playing forward. It's like they have perfect chances to hit the ball and keep it in the zone and they just back out. And that's a very like division one platinum and gold thing to do is to back off way too much. And that's gonna be tip number one. If you're gonna play forward, play forward. You gotta read the opponent and actually see, oh, they are gonna uh, hit it back. Unless if you're playing center, but then you're relying on your teammate to be the forward. If you're, and that's how rotation works. If you're forward, your teammate should be back. And so then you shouldn't have to worry about screwing up. Also, people trying, trying to do fancy things and they obviously didn't try it out beforehand. They are just trying it out in competitive. Play casual if you're going to do that. Or go into free mode. Or any of the 5 million training exercises there are. There's websites to show that, you know, different training exercises. Don't try your complex stuff that you're not comfortable with in competitive. Ugh. Alright, so I just spotted a bunch of shit there. But, major point number one. Play, when, if you're gonna play forward, play forward. Stop playing too defensively. And then when you play defensively, don't whiff every time. Like, actually, go try to clear the ball instead of not clearing the ball. I understand things happen, but, uh... You can't be juggling the ball with the, the players constantly. Alright. I know it's not technically wise for both people in that position to go for it in doubles. But I like to do that because even though, yeah, it's definitely technically a rookie move. But if I could pinch it with my teammate... It tends to go a lot farther into their zone instead of me trusting the one person to go for it. 
And there we go, our first goal. Finally, finally got a good, oh, a good enough shot. Like, okay, there we go. There we go. There's our second goal immediately. See, see, see what I'm doing there. What a lot of people don't do. Oh shit. Is just because I see an uh, opportunity to hit the ball doesn't mean I will actually go for the ball. I see that he was one in front of me, two, he had technically a better shot. So I decided to back off. Hey look, I'm level 152, what up? I decide to back off because he has the better shot. Just because the ball is there and I'm sure whoever I get next might do that. Just because you can hit the ball doesn't mean you should hit the ball. That is a very important rule. Just because, and I, I've, I've yelled loudly about this on even on streams. You know, like, the ball's here. The goal is here. I'm going for the ball here. But the guy's like, oh, I could hit it. But he's way the fuck over here. And he's going to hit it away from the goal just because, hey, I have the chance to actually hit it. Even though I have the better shot. Pay attention to what your teammates are doing. You're not playing singles. You're playing duos or 3v3s. You are not playing by yourself, so don't act like it. Tips, motherfuckers, tips. I got him as a platinum player, even though there's champs out there that are way the fuck better than I am at this game. That was a shitty hit, I'm not gonna lie. But it was on goal, so that's all I could ask for. And I, and I might do a couple things that piss me off about what, how I play, I'm going to probably say. Uh, and if other people do it, I yell at them, even though I, I'd be a little bit of a hypocrite, but it makes sense. Because I still hate it. Because then I beat myself up for it, so I'm going to beat somebody else up for it as well. Because I'm an equal opportunist when it comes to anger. Oh, I fucked that up. I fucked that up. I'm going to step back. He has a shot now. And he whiffed it. He was trying too hard. All right, it's centered. I'm going to step away because I hope he's there. He fucking whiffed it. If you can't fly, don't fly. Ow. Uh. See, so what? a lot of what he's doing, he's just hitting the ball towards their side. He's not really paying attention to where he's hitting it and how he's hitting it. He's just kind of hitting it. Like you can see there, he's just trying everything he can to hit it. He's just, he's just doing everything he can to hit it. He's not going on goal. Do I have, no, he has a goal. Like he, he's technically in his mind, he is trying to hit it towards the goal, but he's not actually thinking about how he's hitting it. And he's whiffing 75% of the time. You. As a goal player, I expect a little bit better accuracy. And not... There is a ch... What the f... That's what I mean by don't hit the ball just because you can't. He's hitting the ball every single chance he gets. I would have saved the ball hardcore. But then he does that. He, he scored it for them. Just because you can hit the ball. And, that, and that's going to be the theme of this episode. Just because you can hit the ball doesn't mean you should. And in that case, there was you should you should have not at all. It was there was nothing good that would have come out of you hitting the ball. You fucking idiot. But yet you do it anyway. I thought I was gonna tip it. That was that was kinda poor on me, but that was one mishap out of <sighs> I hate this guy. I actually hate this guy. He's hitting, he's hit, just hitting the ball because he wants to hit the ball. And I don't think I've ever really talked about this in streams or when I'm bitching. Oh, fucking Christ. Like, I don't think I've ever seen somebody so idiotically dumb about how to go about hitting the ball before. In ranked, at least. If you're gonna... Hmm. 
Don't hit the ball. If it's not smart to hit the ball, or just. See, like, fucking up shots is one thing, but at least try to aim your shot. He's just, he's just fucking flailing about. Like, I don't think he, it doesn't feel like he actually knows how to play the fucking game. And see, he's just flying because he can, because he can fly. But it's not, it's not actually, it's not working. Everything you're doing is not working. I don't trust him to guard the ball, so I'm playing Mad D right now. Because I absolutely do not trust him. Like, I, tr I, I start off games trusting the person, no matter what. Because they... STOP HITTING THE FUCKING BALL! YOU STUPID IDIOT! HOLY SHIT! I'm just gonna fucking. He is one. He's the worst fucking gold player I have ever played with. He. Like, the first guy I played with this video, like, fucking Karma. I don't believe in it, but it fucking happened. Like, the guy was actually good and he knew how to do everything correctly. This guy doesn't know how to. I, he's, I hardly believe he knows how to hold a controller correctly. Jesus Christ, how bad can he be in fucking gold? Ugh, fucking Christ. Like, I know gold isn't that high. I mean, I'm just used to playing with platinum players, and now I'm on a gold account, which is really annoying. Fucking Christ, you suck. Every ounce of wiener. All right, so let's review everything that went wrong in that match. So tip number one with that one. Don't hit the ball if you don't have to. Just because the ball is there doesn't mean you get to hit the ball. Everybody is in better positions, probably. If you pay attention to your surroundings, if you know a player will be in a better position, then don't hit the ball. Two. You don't always have to hit the ball. Now, this is not just seeing the chance. Always trying for it, even when you don't have a chance. Just always hitting the ball doesn't mean anything. Three, accuracy. Work on your accuracy. If you hit, Just because you hit the ball doesn't mean you're playing good. You can hit the ball five million times but and have it go nowhere near the goal. That just means you're playing bad. You're not, you don't pay attention to what you're doing. All you're doing is hitting and hitting and hitting and hope something happens. And then possibly, oh, it's near the goal. Now I'm going to hit it. Which is probably the only times you ever hit, actually get a goal is on a completely open net when it's right next to the goal. Because you can't aim worth a damn. And I wouldn't be as mad if it wasn't ranked. If this was casual, then I wouldn't be mad. If this was... I, I, if I just watched you play free play and training, I wouldn't be mad. But since you are ranked and you obviously got carried to the point where you're almost platinum, but you shouldn't be, then that's when I get mad. Is when I see shitty play in ranked. Why or how are you confident enough to be in ranked and play that bad? So if you, uh, thanks for listening to my rant, uh, and me yelling at that guy for being stupid. If you like this episode, thumbs up. If you want to see more from us, subscribe. And until next time. Bye.